Wow, what you got? <laughs> I've got chili and rice. I think uh, Diane was a bit disappointed at the size of my bowl, thinking it's small, but it's quite deep that. And they did yeah. say, if you want to come back for more, come back for more. Uh, me and, oh, bless him. We're going to bury him what? tomorrow. What? Oh, no, no, hold on. Right, where did he come from? I'm literally shocked. Where has he come from? Didn't you watch last night's video? He was underneath the poor wheel. He died. So he ain't risen from the dead, is he? No, I've taken him from under the wheel and we're going to bury him in the morning. Probably in this oh. video, actually. Poor thing. Rest in peace, my friend. Right, chilly it is. Beautiful. Hurry up, hurry up. There you go. So this is actually kindly done by Boatheads on Tour. Boathead on Tour. Diane made this. Chilly. She said I can go back for as much as I want. Does she mean at 3am 3, 3 in the morning? She'll regret saying that. Yeah, because you call me at 3am in the morning. <laughs> How is it? It's absolutely beautiful, Mazza. Is it spicy? It is. It's got a rice. Right it? <laughs> I can smell it. I'll be I honest. I just coughed a bit of rice back up. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's got a right kick to it, which I like. I love a kick. Yep. Yeah. Leave me to it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you asked for it. Good morning. No, I haven't been baking. It smells like. <laughs> <laughs> you know when grandma's made uh, chocolate buns mm. it smells like chocolate buns it does i've lit for the first time this morning now my yankee easter candle because this one's empty so that needs to go in the bin now yay and i've just lit that it smells gorgeous well Cho it is easter eggs. <laughs> i was gonna say it's easter after in all. fact yeah the picture is them uh, rice oh, krispies yeah. with chocolate on that's what it smells like i love making those i didn't think to do that in fact it's got bits in it i bet you all that's just uh, the mixture it looks like chocolate brownie if i'm honest it smells nice right so <sighs> it's easter weekend and we're not really sure what to do i mean we had options but the kind of jobs i want to do today we don't want to be making noise disturbing people no, enjoying it, their weekends it would away. have been perfect to do the grass today but uh, don't yeah. be making a noise it's so peaceful here today yeah i don't want to spoil people's weekends <clears throat> so uh the other job i was thinking of then well let's drill and put your um lights on the vents <laughs> and it's then not I thought, finished well we could have done some of them but again it's noise isn't it i don't want to be no, that wouldn't be noisy but no we need to complete the fence before we do that think that's one job i don't want to do today no. though <laughs> um, let me come in with you <laughs> so you're going back to cleaning today yeah i'm gonna do the actual plates for the barbecue and i think i might oh. actually make the sausage patty oh, you're just have a sandwich have a barbecue? not for tea just for like oh, a breakfast. snack okay all that for breakfast butty and then you've got to clean it all again yeah did you find your hose I found the hose, yes, so I can cook. Now, personally, today, I don't really want to get involved in the cleaning because I had enough of that yesterday. I actually don't took quite to a long time. I involved in it, but unfortunately, these things need <laughs> doing. We did finish it, though, with our top to bottom, didn't we? And it come out so Yeah, it looks so, fantastic now. Yeah. Uh, I would just like to thank, by the way, Diane um, from Boathead on Tour. She made a chili oh, last yes. night. Wow. Yeah, bless her. It was yeah. just like a mum's chilli, but it was hot, and I love hot. Yeah, you did say it was quite spicy, yeah. didn't you? Mums, mums never make <laughs> chillies hot, you see. I think you said Neil probably would have struggled with that, because Neil doesn't actually like spicy food. Well, we don't know how spicy he likes things, do we? No, but He did no. say he prefers a karma to a vindaloo. Yeah, yeah. So I'm guessing, I might, he might have struggled with that, because it was really quite hot, it was beautiful, oh. so thank you very much. I feel like we've got to keep our voices down, because it's so no, we peaceful. Haven't. Mazzy, everyone knows yeah. who we are around here. I had a beer with him next door last night do you well what, this one here was yesterday it? afternoon it, 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 was it this one i thought it was this one over there mm. it was this one over there you're getting confused 
No, I think it, I don't know. It were him or him anyway. He came over, he put a John Smith on top of me. <laughs> storage box it was the other one so it looks like we're gonna have nice weather today so yeah and it's easter weekend what so do you want to we do? might not even get a video up tonight we're not sure we're Probably just gonna not. chill out aren't we i'm gonna see Try if i and got some chocolate and make some homemade candy or sweets that's a good idea make some buns no no chocolate i don't buns. have all them ingredients but i do have cornflakes I'm wondering whether to make chocolate cornflakes. Yeah. Well, we've got plenty of chocolate. We've got cornflakes. No, you can't melt that kind of chocolate, though, can you? I don't know. But my arm's aching from know. holding this, so can I turn it off now? Yeah. Back in a bit. So I've had plenty of practice with my new kettle now. Um, what I have established, just filling it halfway, actually, is more than sufficient. And it cuts the time right down. So I'm well pleased with that. Let's go and see what Dan's doing. Are you going to show this plate? Yeah. I'm just getting power ready for it. I need to get in the other side of that and see if we've got any any chocolate. I just thought it is going to be quite noisy, this steamer, but it's only for five minutes. Oh, we've had great weather. This this is actually still still pretty soggy, isn't it, babe? Very. It just doesn't seem to want to absorb. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with the ground round here. What I need is for you to put water in this if you no, want. No, you can't turn it on until it's got water in. Turn it off quick, unplug it. Oh. So I've got it at a nice level. It is doing on the sides and bottom as well, but I'm just going to concentrate on the top. You can see it's like slight rusty, oxidised, whatever it's done, I don't know. It's fat, you can feel it. I do <laughs> think this is going to come up nice. Let's crack on. So we're starting with the pink stuff. I don't want to rub too hard, but I am going to rub over it quite a few times. I'm going to give this a proper going over. You should do half and half again just to see yeah i'm gonna do see the difference i do feel this half looks worse here so you ready yeah mm. i'm not sure about this one but let's give it a go yeah the light on it properly so you can tell which half Dan's done. I've done that and it looks beautiful. Yeah. That's still to do. This half, left half Dan's done. Brilliant stuff. Very yeah, impressed. so it has gotten a lot off. Don't get us wrong, there's still little bits, but... I'd eat off that. But it's very good. Well done, babe. Thank you very much. If you finish that off now, I'm uh, going have a little <laughs> No, I told you. <laughs> so I've given that a once over. I'm happy with that. That is looking a lot better. Brilliant. So I'll be cooking on that later on, I think. And what we're actually going to do today is uh, arrange home delivery from Tesco's for a Tesco's delivery. Monday. Because we're running low on a few things, aren't we? We are. We are. But everything I want, Tesco's don't seem to have it. It's getting on my nerves. So I can't get no salad. Can't get mini eggs for me chocolate um, cornflakes I want to make. They don't have any big packs of John Smith's. No. <laughs> so I'm having to order four cans instead of packs. Uh, not looking good. But have no. you noticed recently, I know they've said there's a shortage of salads and stuff. But the lettuce, what they do have, it's all brown and it's manky, disgusting. Yeah, and I. Out of all the lettuces on their website, they've only got one in stock, it says. And I know it'll be only three bags left on the shelf, that it will be the three bags that no one else mm. wants. So we're going to put some things together anyway. I'll get that yeah, on Monday. Yeah. And then we can relax because I really don't want to be going out yeah. early next week. Um, I'm still dreading <laughs> trying to get off here. Um, you know, we'll manage, but it is due to rain again on Monday, 
so I'm not going to go to too much trouble there I'd rather just sit in and relax for a bit on the nurseries not going to be baking today got no chocolate and uh, supplies and cupcake cases and stuff but check my candle outlet look at that looks like melted chocolate oh I could get a straw to that all right I need a sticker for somebody let's go what a horrible 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 day I'm no looking any better than out there. <laughs> what are you put it on me for? <laughs> sick of it, man. Absolutely yeah. sick of it. It's putting a dampener on it, isn't it? You know, <sighs> the only good news is everyone who came away for Easter... Yeah, had um, a good weekend. The weather was nice. Yeah. But um, today, when everyone's leaving, miserable. Hope they all get off all right. <laughs> We're stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone. Good morning. <laughs> Again, big gap in videos. Yeah, I know. We've just, I mean, when we're painting the fence, we, it's trying to do everything and we just can't, can we? No. It's a matter of just doing it. <laughs> so today we have yeah. someone new coming on campsite. Oh, mm. don't tell them yet. Don't tell them. <laughs> okay, yet. some a blast from the past. Yep. Mm. Is coming. It's been very nice to catch up with them. Yeah. <laughs> um, and you've just ordered something. Hold on, let's talk about your delivery first. My delivery? What's my delivery? You've got it coming between two or three today. That's. Oh, yeah, your Tesco <laughs> shopping. <laughs> well excited. <laughs> two till three. Yeah, so I've ordered my new phone this morning. I was still in debate. I was entitled to an upgrade quite a few months ago and I just didn't know whether to or not and my phone's just it's just dying. <laughs> it's rubbish. Yeah. It's one problem well, it's lasted after you a another. few years. Yeah, yeah. It's done the job. But the best news is she's leaving Apple and she's coming over to Samsung. I am. I hope I'm doing the right thing. Well you are, apart from the fact you've ordered the Ultra. Samsung S23 Ultra. The massive, massive things, and I, I, I really think like you've ordered the wrong I one. All I ever use it for is to watch TV on anyway and put my radio on in the mornings. Too big. I don't walk around it with it in my pocket. There's times I even go out, I don't even bring my phone, isn't there? Well, good luck with your Ultra. Thank you. I hate new phones, though. It's going to be a nightmare. You're going to have to help me. No, 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 yes, no, you no, are. no, 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 no. Well, if I'd known that, I wouldn't have bothered getting it, ordering cancel it. Cancel it, then. Go on, cancel it. I will. It. I will. I bet she done. Bet she done. <laughs> yeah. Don't know what we're doing. We're just stuck in the van. Um, can't do any jobs outside. I've got nothing to do inside, so it's just one of them days again. Now right, we're getting rubbish at vlogging. I know. We need to snap out of it. The, we yeah, need the weather. We, tell us what we're supposed to vlog when the weather's like this. You lot tell us. We need help. We could have a game of chess. I don't... Live. ...know how to play chess. What's the other one? Drafts. Yeah, I kind of know how... Well, yeah, I know how to play that. Tiddlywinks. <sighs> anyway. Yeah, forget that. It might be raining outside, but it doesn't mean to say I can't open my new toy. <laughs> my Black & Decker 18 volt lithium 1.5ah 40nm uh, drill. Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah, go on. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, you want to have seen him, but as soon as that case opened, his eyes was like... You were like a little kid in a toy store. Now, what I really like straight away oh. is attached to it here, look, is your screwdriver, both sides, straight in. Ready to go, are we? Should be. Literally ready to screwdrive, Mazzy. Yep. And? It would do for what you need it for, won't it? <laughs> And if I need to do any more than screw driving, 
Ooh. It's only a 50 piece drill and bit set. It's got spiral <laughs> drills, masonry drills, wood drills, magnetic bit holders. It's got the lot in there. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, open that as well. Let's <laughs> scissors. Oh, you just are. had them. I've had this about two weeks and I haven't opened it. Yeah, I know. It's not like mm. me. I normally open things straight away. So what's your plans with this? Drill stuff. Comp clip, comp no, you can't just drill stuff. I can. Look <laughs> at all these, look. Mm -hmm. You've got all them. Yeah, for how good they are, I don't know, but for the jobs you'll be needing them for, hey, sure that'll come fine. in handy, won't it? If that runs out of battery, see, if the drill runs out of battery, yeah, I can just yeah. stick that in there and do it by hand. Yeah. Oh no, that doesn't fit. Well, and that's what it's do... for, isn't it? No. Yeah, you'd put this on first, would you? Not a drill, though. Not a drill piece. I don't know. No, you put that in there and then you put a screwdriver or a does it fit a drill bit no no well, you can't drill by hand can you of course okay? you can do you not remember the old style drills yeah, you and you used to have to turn the hand oh, oh. this hasn't got one of them no it's not for them it would have been a good tool if it could have done <laughs> but yeah buzzing mm -hmm. really really impressed really happy brilliant it's going to change mm -hmm. our lives we can drill we can fix i can fix you can watch me fix, you can film me fix, we can fix together, we can have fixing parties and just drill loads of times. Well, all the things you've broken over the years, you've got a lot to fix, boy. Oh, I need to charge you up. I know I shouldn't be filming. <laughs> just got our Tesco's delivery and she's stuck, bless her. Then other lads have had to come up and Think about trying to push her out. Right, I think you there, Mark. I'll you go there. I'll go in there. I'll go here, yeah? Right, go! Go on, boys! Be careful, babe. Oh dear, she ain't happy. <laughs> Are you right? You've just hurt yourself. Yeah. <sighs> While the boys are dealing with her, oh bless her, I feel really bad. I'm just gonna try and stick some tea on. So Dan wants beef burgers tonight and some buns. I'm gonna get some gastro chips on the go. These rolls were a substitute to crusty, like fresh rolls. I'm happy with those, but what can you do? And this is a new hot sauce Dan has gotten himself today. It's Frank's Red Hot Smoked Chipotle. Chipotle. Apparently it's like got a smoky flavour to it. And I've got him some little jacket potatoes in the oven as well. Let's get back to the boys. Here we go. Neil's got his cardboard box. Oh, that's thunder. Do you hear it? And this is exactly why Neil didn't want anyone here over the bank holiday weekend on grass pitches. my lovely go on oh thunder and lightning's coming
some kind of thumbnail with that and Tesco van. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting soaked feet here. I've got slippers on and all sorts. <laughs> yeah, been towed out. Bless her. I think she was panicking. Look at the state of this look. Look at that. Yeah, it's all kicking off around here. Well done, boys. Thank you, Neil. <laughs> I feel well bad. <laughs> when Tesco deliveries go wrong. And it did, big time. Right, firstly, I just want to point out when the lady arrived, which is very nice that they do deliver to campsites like that, Neil made it very clear, um, just stick to the gravel, don't go on the grass and you'll be fine. She came up here and I'd, I'd already worked it out. Right, this is us. She was coming down here, so I'd worked it out, all she has to do, come in here, straight drive in, unload, and I even said to her, you don't have to go on the grass, it's all wet. See the puddle, look, it, it's a nightmare around here. Um, you don't have to go on the grass, I'll just take them from the van and bring them back and forth. She says, no, it's okay, I've just been to a campsite, I'm used to it, no problem. So she was taking them to the side of the van over this. We got the delivery, everything's fine. And then I say, right, whatever you do, just make sure you stick to the gravel. Just reverse up there and then straight out. I'll go down to the gate to let you out because you need a, a security fob to get in and out. Okay, so I went down there. I must have been waiting 10 minutes before my phone rings. Mazzy. She's stuck. She's stuck. I says, how can she be stuck? Did she go on grass? Yeah. And apparently she got stuck. And I've seen the footage. I'm not going to put this footage in because it's... It's not the best. But instead of... Instead of reversing with a wheel like here... A, a wheel was right over here. I don't know if... This is where she parked, I guess there look there look it goes straight through there and she didn't turn till there she had all that so she pretty much reversed right up to the curb here and then when she was going out she had so much room to work with this isn't too deep you're not going to get stuck in this she went over the grass and got stuck and then apparently she started braying on the van can you get your other half please as if it's our fault when we made it very clear I can see honestly there was a lot of trying to get her out pushing backwards pushing forwards I am filthy uh, look at the massive dint in the grass there but we managed in the end we had to pull her out we pulled her out and then she was happy but she was getting quite stroppy Some people don't cope very well in situations like that and they do panic and their way of reacting is to be a bit uh, on the defensive or attack. And she was like, this is why I don't like coming to campsites. Uh, shouldn't have to come to this camp. You know, that kind of attitude, having to go at us as if we'd done something wrong but we've made it very clear, don't go on the grass. And the way she reversed, out of there this is her right wheel she came out of there and she a right wheel were here it should have been here so it was the way she drove but i'll tell you what she will be going back to tesco's and saying don't deliver there again it's not safe i can guarantee this campsite is going to be banned from tesco deliveries and it ain't our fault it's hers let's just fake karen anyway and call this vlogger a day yeah who's karen oh, the driver was that her name <laughs> she was a karen wasn't she <laughs> no i'm sure no, she, i'm only joking i'm she sure lovely. she's a lovely woman but some women do turn a bit nasty in panicky situations i'll be honest right she and was she did. lovely unloading all our shopping she was absolutely lovely and next thing then i know you'd gone off to go and see our friend that we haven't discussed who's arrived yet 
And next thing, she's banging on me door. Where's your other half and all this? She was like, where's I've your half? I've just said all you... this, Mazza. I've anyway, just said all this. That's why her she name turned. is Karen. She turned. <laughs> yeah, anyway, she did. Anyway. We got us, we got us delivery. <laughs> she did get away. Um, luckily, and I, I do mean this, luckily, she didn't shout at me. If she had done, I'd have probably just left her there in the mud. Let's just call it a day. We're grateful to have our no, shopping. No, I'm not leaving it there. Oh. Because it's not my responsibility or the campsite's responsibility to get her out if she's stuck. Uh, we could have just left her there, but we didn't. We got her out. Um, anyway, all said and done, we've got us delivery. I doubt they'll deliver her again. But hey, another eventful day at the nurseries. <laughs> Uh, on top of that, Mazza keeps saying we're, we're not saying who it is yet, we're not saying who it is yet. We are going to say who it is. We have got a guest. I'll tell you why we're going to say who it is, Mazza, because it, it, it won't be on camera anywhere. He's, he's shy, he doesn't like he cameras. Is shy, yeah. It is Owen and Barbara. Owen? Owen. Owen. And Barbara from Ireland. Can you from remember? From Ireland, the campsite. Who put us up on the campsite in took, Ireland. Took care of us. If it wasn't for them, <laughs> yeah. our mummy and daddy <laughs> in Ireland. So they're here for three nights, I think they are, aren't they? Yes, so they've arrived, just been yeah. having a chat with Owen. Yeah. The weather's been atrocious today, it's not too bad now. We'll catch up properly but with them I've tomorrow, said, yeah. yeah. Leave it till tomorrow, <laughs> let them settle in. It's supposed to be a blue sky all tomorrow, so yeah. hopefully get catch up with them tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. Right, let's leave it at that. Let's leave it, yeah. Love you all to bits, hang on. Yeah. Can you just hold that a second? Yep. I hope she comes back next Sunday, by the way. <laughs> Oh, as a deliverer? Oh, yeah. She better do. Uh, can we also just give super thanks to Big Lynn and Tony. Oh, thank you, Lynn and Tony. And Andy Steptoe. And thank you, Andy Steptoe. Thank you very much. Andy Steptoe, thank you very did, much. Did, 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 did. I love Steptoe and Son, especially the black and white ones. Right, cool it a day. Uh, catch you all tomorrow, hopefully, yeah. but we're not guaranteeing anymore because we let you down so many times, don't we? It's just hard when it's raining. Let us know what we're supposed to film. There is a few jobs what need filming, Mazzy. As long as it don't involve that black and dirty drill. It does. I've got some drilling to do. Uh, I've got ten of these babies, these solar lights. I think I'm going to put one on each of these posts, so far on the back. And they're not bright they're just a little a little dim light they're really nice uh we'll put a couple up here maybe three up here and three up here just to it's just a twinkle really it's really nice so i've got them to put up and i've also got to put a new uh, uh hinge on here because that's broke so the drill will be coming out tomorrow see you soon Bye.